the mechanical bird. An airplane is a powered, fixed-wing aircraft that is propelled forward by thrust from a jet engine or propeller. Airplanes come in a variety of sizes, shapes, and wing configurations. The broad spectrum of uses for airplanes includes recreation, transportation of goods and people, military, and research. Commercial aviation is a massive industry involving the flying of tens of thousands of passengers daily on airliners. Most airplanes are flown by a pilot on board the aircraft, but some are designed to be remotely or computer controlled. The Wright brothers invented and flew the first airplane in 1903, recognized as the first sustained and controlled heavier-than-air powered flight. They built on the works of George Cayley dating from 1799, when he set forth the concept of the modern airplane. Between 1867 and 1896, the German pioneer of human aviation Otto Lilienthal also studied heavier-than-air flight. Following its limited use in World War I, aircraft technology continued to develop. Airplanes had a presence in all the major battles of World War II. The first jet aircraft was the German Heinkel He 178 in 1939. The first jet airliner, the de Havilland Comet, was introduced in 1952. The Boeing 707, the first widely successful commercial jet, was in commercial service for more than 50 years, from 1958 to at least 2013. Many stories from antiquity involve flight, such as the Greek legend of Icarus and Daedalus, and the Vimana in ancient Indian epics. Around 400 BC in Greece, Archytas was reputed to have designed and built the first artificial, self-propelled flying device. A bird-shaped model propelled by a jet of what was probably steam, said to have flown some 200 meters. Leonardo da Vinci researched the wing design of birds and designed a man-powered aircraft in his Codex on the flight of birds. In 1799, George Gailey set forth the concept of the modern airplane as a fixed-wing flying machine with separate systems for lift, propulsion, and control. Cayley was building and flying models of fixed-wing aircraft as early as 1803, and he built a successful passenger-carrying glider in 1853. In 1856, Frenchman Jean-Marie Le Brime made the first powered flight, by having his glider pulled by a horse on a beach. Sir Hiram Maxim built a craft that weighed 3.5 tons, with a 34-meter wingspan that was powered by two 360-horsepower steam engines driving two propellers. In 1894, his machine was tested with overhead rails to prevent it from rising. The test showed that it had enough lift to take off. The craft was uncontrollable, which Maxim realized, because he subsequently abandoned work on it. The structural parts of a fixed-wing aircraft are called the airframe. Early types were usually made of wood with fabric wing surfaces. When engines became available for powered flight around a hundred years ago, their mounts were made of metal. Then as speeds increased more and more parts became metal until by the end of World War II all metal aircraft were common. In modern times, increasing use of composite materials has been made. Typical structural parts include, one or more large horizontal wings, often with an airfoil cross-section shape, a fuselage, a long thin body, usually with tapered or rounded ends to make its shape aerodynamically smooth, a vertical stabilizer or fin is a vertical wing-like surface mounted at the rear of the plane and typically protruding above it, a horizontal stabilizer or tail plane, usually mounted at the tail near the vertical stabilizer, landing gear, a set of wheels, skids, or floats that support the plane while it is on the surface. When risk is measured by deaths per passenger kilometer, air travel is approximately 10 times safer than travel by bus or rail. However, when using the deaths per journey statistic, air travel is significantly more dangerous than car, rail, or bus travel. Air travel insurance is relatively expensive for this reason, insurers generally use the deaths per journey statistic. There is a significant difference between the safety of airliners and that of smaller private planes, 
with the Pamile statistic indicating that airliners are 8.3 times safer than smaller planes.